Testing, testing, one, two, three. Okay, sound pretty good. All right. Hello, hello. Oh, gotta get my, let's see, got my microphone. get myself set up here okay here we go okay so I'm going to go live right now <coughs> in my introduction there we go oh hello everybody ah. there we go oh what happened to my camera ah. Ah. There you go. Hello, here. All right. Okay. Hello, my beautiful glam queens. Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, I'm Alicia, lover of makeup and glam rock gear. Yeah. And today is my birthday. Woohoo! Happy birthday to me. <laughs> uh, my birthday stream. Yeah. So, today. We are going to do the Nick Nocturnal Votes. Yes. I'm going to try to set it up here. I think I got this down. So they want me to uh, put the display on. Oh, hopefully I get this right. Yes. Yes, I did. And then, well, first we've got to turn that off. Uh, I don't know why. They make this so difficult. And I've seen people doing it easier. Much easier. Can you see it? Yeah, you can see my screen. Oh. We got this. I got this. I'm doing it. Okay, making me low. And then the other one. Let's check it out. Go big. Whoa. Got this? I think we got this. Yes. And then we're going to make this big. See how it looks like on my <coughs> video here. <coughs> so we're going to do the Nick Nocturnal Awards here live. Yes. Oh yes, looks good. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> so, uh, this is basically me putting a little bit of rock and roll back into this channel. <laughs> and we're going to start that off with the Nick Nocturnal. Uh, so that is a YouTuber who has created this award show celebrating heavy metal and since they get forgotten a lot in the uh, Grammy Awards, the regular popular ones. <laughs> so. Oh, yeah. Okay, I thought something happened. 
but we're good. Okay, so we're going to start off with the first one, breakdown of the year. <clears throat> I wrote these down ahead of time so I don't forget. Because sometimes I have three choices and I want to forget. <laughs> okay, breakdown of the year. So, alt. I never heard this man. Uh, the Oh, it's so small on my screen. Yeah, it's small. No, don't vote for them. I don't want to vote for them. <laughs> okay, so breakdown of the year. My vote is going with the Venom song. Because I felt like that was the heaviest. With this J-Rock band. Yes, I was going to go for Chelsea Grin. They're my usual suspects, but um, I'm not going for them this time around. Okay. Oh, I keep scrolling up. Let me see if my scrolling shows. Yeah, we're good. <coughs> Animal noise of the year. Okay, this one was a tough one for me. I really wanted to pick Little Uzi. Um, because he had some bird noises. He was going, ah, 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 like that. Um, <laughs> in the beginning, before he was starting Chop Suey. Um, uh, no, I'm going to go, uh, let's see, I wrote it down. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm glad I wrote it down because my computer's too far away. Uh, Christmas, Christmas present. I need a Christmas present to bring my computer a lot closer. Slaughter to Prevail, the Viking song. Yes, that one was a good one. I love that sound. Much, much better than all the other ones. Ice Nine Kills. I was going to pick them because I saw them live. Um, but that song was in this category. Uh, it was, yeah, for me it was Lil Uzi versus Slaughter to Prevail. I'm going with Slaughter to Prevail because that was a pretty cool Viking song. Um, kind of into that kind of music, the Viking music. There's a video game, by the way, in the VR. <laughs> they have a uh, Viking music that you play around. I don't know how to do it. My boyfriend plays those games. I'm really bad at the like rock band kind of games. Okay. <clears throat> Guitarist of the year. Okay, first person I noticed was uh, Nita Strauss. She played with Alice Cooper. I'm going to pick her. Oh, but the Avenged Sevenfold guys are here. Ah, uh, that's right. That's the issue I was having. No, I'm still going to go with Nita. I'm going to give it for Nita. That was the issue I was having. Yeah, I wanted either them or them. Yeah, we're going to go for Nita. Because I choose to. Okay. <laughs> Drummer of the year. Okay. Drummer of the year. Oh, let's see. Chris Turner. That was this one. Okay. Sleep token. Me. It was okay. All of them were like okay, but Chris Turner I felt like was the strongest drummer in this category here yeah definitely he was definitely playing really good usually does vocalist of the year <sighs> yeah Andy I'm going with Andy okay so it was either I have a few actually then this one was the hardest uh, I liked Shani Shani I believe 
Uh, I did like Kyle, but then I uh, uh, Vessel, o Ollie, Oli, of course, Oli, Oli. Uh, but I'm going to go with Andy. His voice took me by surprise. Saw him with Moist Critical, that that band that Moist Critical has. Um, <clears throat> it was very interesting. Very interesting vocals. Yeah, he's probably my favorite. Okay, bases of the year. Mm, which one did I go for here? No, not CPU. <laughs> I can't believe they even... No. Um, <laughs> bases of the year. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so I was going to just go with the Metallica, Robert, because I've seen Metallica live. Uh, yes, Robert's my favorite band member, believe it or not. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I feel like I should go for the underdog. Oh, let's see. Was it Cal? Yeah, well, no, maybe I should just go for Robert now. Hmm. Oliver, I was thinking of Oliver. This one's a tough one for me. Hmm. I mean, he's not really an underdog. They've been around for a while, too. Cattle decaptation. Robert. Now I feel like I should just go with Robert. Because they've both been... Uh, in the business for a while everybody else everybody else is an underdog um oh this is hard yeah i'm just gonna go with robert i'm gonna do it i'm just gonna go with robert the usual metallica usual suspect i don't know okay angriest song of the year this one was hard they all sounded angry to me <laughs> let's see who did i write i wrote Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Uh, Throne. This was a hard choice, but I chose Throne by Throne. Throne. Guilt. Filth. Uh, the Plot in You Forgotten. That one was pretty good. Uh, they were all okay. Eh. Eh. That's that, yeah, that was the best one that I got into. Hmm. Still deciding on that one. These were tough. Hmm. Okay, yeah, we're just going to say with the own. <clears throat> that was a tough one. Mm, that was a good one, though. I'm looking at them over again, trying to remember if I liked. Mm, yeah. That's it. All right. That's a hard one. I can't. I can't choose. I can't choose. I'm just going with what I wrote down because that's how I felt at the time. <laughs> okay, Batty Core Song of the Year. Of course, I had to go with the Megan Thee Stallion and Spirit Box. Cobra. Yeah. Because I actually heard that song. I don't like bad wolves. Poppy, meh, don't like poppy. This is the only song from this category here that I played probably a few times already. Sleep Token. No, I don't really listen to Sleep Token. My nephew does. Mm, catchiest chorus of the year. Mm. <laughs> Let's see. No, <laughs> this one I did hear. Nothing, nowhere. I, I, that one I heard uh, quite a few times. <laughs> but 
but no, we're not going with, we're not going with that song. <laughs> um, Cadre's Court, okay. Oh, I don't even have a choice here. I wrote three of them. Oh, you know what? That one got stuck in my head. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Oh, yeah, Bring Me the Horizon. Yeah. Oh. Okay, well, this is the one that got stuck in my head, so I should choose that one. Catchiest chorus of the year. Deception, make them suffer. So what? Uh, uh, there was another one. I cannot find it now. Oh, yeah, Desolation. Oh, dude, it's right above them. Uh, that one got stuck in my head for a while, but guess what? We're going with it's hell down here. Feels are reals. None of these really gave me the feels. But we're going with bear tooth. Bear tooth. Yeah, that's how I wrote down. Bear tooth. That's so funny. <coughs> oh, I'm just saying it's so funny how I changed my mind on this one. Because <clears throat> uh, when I first looked at this list, I was going with Desolation. But now, today, I'm feeling like... Because this is the song that actually got stuck in my head for a while. Okay. Beartooth. I was alive. That's the only one that got me a little bit in my feels. But other than that, nah. Everything else was kind of like, meh. Okay. Best metal head to follow, Anthony Fentano. Not really a metal head, but he's the only one I actually really watch out of all of them. Uh, yes. And then best metal content creator. Oh, I forgot we could make this bigger, can't we? How do I do that, everybody? View. Zoom in. My old lady eyes can't. <laughs> my oh yeah, and it's my birthday today. I just got a year older. Oh, okay. Here we go. Oh my gosh, that's so much better. Ah, uh, life is good again. Okay, best metal content creator, Finn McKenty, because last year I made a plan to watch every single one of his videos, um, on his channel which I have succeeded. And then I was supposed to go to somebody else's channel, but then I decided to start watching other things on YouTube. The whole SSS Sniper Wolf kind of took my life. I started watching like the Jack films. Oh yeah, I watched all of those videos. <laughs> all of Jack films slash SSS. Oh, I guess he's JJJ Jack films on there. That's the videos I started watching. So then I got backed up again with Fim and Kinti. I'm probably like uh, three months behind now again. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. He's the one who I watch. So we're going to go with him. <clears throat> Best metal news source. Rock feed. Of course. Mm -hmm. I don't like... I don't like Loud Wire. Uh, okay, we don't need to know. Okay, Rock feed. We're going with them. Music video of the year. I was going to go with Ice Nine Kills again. Uh, let's see. Who's... Hmm. This one's a hard one too. And this one I think I didn't even write down because... Yeah, I didn't. Because it's too hard. No, we're not going with Fallen Verse. <laughs> the usual suspects. Mm. Ooh, okay. Forget it. I gotta give Ice Nine Kills one. I gotta do it. Sorry, everybody. I gotta do it. I'm giving in. I have to do it. Best bleh. The song Venom again. Only because... He goes bleh 
in the song and then the lyrics says venom as if he was saying venom but he's actually going bleh so that made me laugh <laughs> so we're going to go with that one <laughs> and then <laughs> breakthrough band of the year <sighs> this is hard one Uh, from Joy Denland Unity mm. Don't like Deadlands Not really <laughs> We're just going to go with the Final Fantasy characters <laughs> That's what everybody was calling them. <laughs> oh. Gotta do it. <laughs> Label of the year. Oh yeah, the only people I get my emails from, Sumerian Records. They're always sending me emails. So we're gonna go with them. Song of the year. We've got so many. Um, oh, this is a hard one. Oh, there's Desolation again. Ooh, should I go with Desolation for the, this one? What did I write here? So I, I wrote nothing. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> this is a hard one for me. <laughs> oh, okay. I want to give it to Avenge Sevenfold because I feel like I should get them one sleep token, the summoning. Hmm, it's hard. It's so hard. Oh! I remember what I was going to do. I was thinking about this for a while. It's been a few days. But we only got till the 13th to vote on this, by the way. If you want to vote, we only have till the 13th. Not very long. So you got to make some quick choices. Quick choices. Yeah. Uh, let's see. In flames. Meter, meter. Uh, okay. So I got desolation. Um. Mattel or Lost by Linkin Park. I was going to go for Lost because when that came out, that made that made me cry. So obviously, <laughs> uh, we're going to go with Lost because I just uh, for them to come out with that was like, oh, why you do this to that one? Got me in my feels. That one got me. Just, you know, nostalgia, listening to Linkin Park in my room and all that. And of course, because of Chesta, EP of the year. Okay. Let's see. Did I write down? Oh, I didn't write it down because I was, there's a few. I was going to give it to, yeah, no, I have to give it to a trio. Because I've seen them twice already in concert. I have to give it to a trio. Yeah. I've seen them twice in concert performing this EP. So this is basically like the only EP I actually really, really listen to. A trio. Okay. Yeah. Everybody else. Eh. Okay. Album of the year. Um... This one was tough because there's so many albums. Like, there's so many albums that there's people missing. Like, Pierce the Veil came out with an album this year. They're not even on this list. Disappointed. Disappointed! Um, that's probably who I would have chosen was Pierce the Veil. But, yeah, that being said, it was a little bit weak, that album. Which is probably why it is in here. Um, <clears throat> oh! And Dolly Parton's rock and roll album. That would have been my vote as well. <sighs> Disappointed. Uh, next year, Nick Nocturno, I'm going to suggest this. Next year, they should have like one blank one so we could write our own choice. <laughs> so I can vote for the Dolly Parton <laughs> rock CD. 
Ah, gosh. Anyways, this was, did I write anything down? Hmm. I did not. I did not. Because I was having a, issues with this one. Okay, I liked the baby metal one. It was okay. Nothing really out of this list. Nothing really caught me. I'm telling you, I was listening to that Dolly Parton one. Uh, my Metallica sleep token. I feel like I should just go for a sleep token because it seemed like everybody's going to go for a sleep token. I feel like they're going to sweep this. Um, Count Corpse, Cattle Decapitation. Okay. Cannibal Corpse. Yes. Maybe. A French Sephifold. Maybe. Hmm. I don't have one. I honestly don't have one. I don't want to give it to Metallica. This time, definitely for sure. Because it was not catchy. Not catchy at all. Suicide Silence, maybe? Hmm. Um, I kind of want to give this one to Beartooth, the surface. <sighs> yeah, I think we're going to do that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I was going to give this a baby medal. But I think I'm going to stick this with bare tooth. Oh, this was a hard one. Oh, this was a hard one. Okay, hard one for me. Oh, should I do baby metal? No, we're going to do bare tooth. Mm -hmm. Submit, submit. Uh, okay. Submit. Your response has been recorded. Yes, yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, now we gotta go back to me. Hello. <laughs> and then we're gonna... Stretch this out. No. This way. No. This way. This way. This way. Oh, put me in the center. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that one made me nervous. Giving it to bear tooth. Ah, okay. I still see no, I think I got it. Let me check my screen here. I think I got me in the center. <coughs> yes, I did. <coughs> okay. Oof, that was a toughie. That was a toughie. Okay, now we're going to continue. Oh my goodness. With our last eight pages of this Ulta Beauty. And then after that, we're going to go see the Marvels <laughs> for my birthday. <laughs> I already had Shaggy's Pizza this morning, by the way. That was very good. Okay. So we got the Ordinary here. You able to see it? Yeah. There it is. The Ordinary. Okay. Moisturize and hydrate. Hyaluronic acid, 2% plus B5 hydrating serum, one ounce. Is this a whole entire thing or are these separate, sold separately? Uh, 890. Then natural moisturizing factors plus HA, daily moisturizer, 3.3 ounces, 13.50. And squalane cleanser, 1.7 ounces, $9. Voila. The ordinary. Okay. 
I don't need this green to be big anymore. There we go. Then first aid beauty, chill out winter skin. Give your sensitive skin the gift of glow with cleansing, exfoliating, plus hydrating essentials. Let's see, 57% savings, exclusive hydrate plus chill kit, $49. It is a $115 value. That is actually pretty, really good. Pretty good. Pretty, really good. <laughs> Voila. Tula Skincare. Give the gift of glow. Oh yeah, by the way, we're doing skincare today. Did I mention? I probably did. Okay. Treat yourself to holiday value kits packed with best-selling skincare. Three full size of the favorites. Cleanse, hydrate, and glow. Mm. Gift of glow. Three-piece full size bestseller kit $68 of 130 value dollar value interesting new and only here at Ulta Ugh, I keep telling myself I'm going to try them but we'll see next year okay ultimate rewards members earn three times the points Wow, but I think it was a certain day-to-day -day thing. <clears throat> oh, offer not valid at Target connected with Ulta Beauty, but it's not really Ulta Beauty, I guess. Okay, a philosophy... Oh, I'm reading it like a sentence. A philosopher... No, uh, letter A... <laughs> Philosophy, hope in a jar, smooth, glow, multitasking, moisturizer, two ounces, $49. That one right there. Juice, beauty, stem, cellular, anti-wrinkle, ceramide, overnight, cream, 1.7 ounces, $75. Wow. Oh. I don't know why I'm really, I don't know why I'm, I'm, the, 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 I don't know why I'm showing you guys the letters. <laughs> supposed to be showing you the products. Okay, so here's A. There's B. Right there. And then C, Clinique, take the day off. Cleansing balm. That is what I wanted to buy. Well, I want to, well, actually... Yeah, no, I did want to buy a cleansing balm. Uh, this one is 3.8 ounces, $38. I did want one of those. Hmm. Okay, D. Hems Ocean Breeze Herbal Body Moisturizer with Hyaluronic Acid, 2.25 ounces, 750 D. Um, hemp's. I feel like everybody has at least one hemp bottle in their house. <coughs> so many everywhere. Hemp is sold everywhere. Yeah. Okay, and then E Beekman eighteen o two o Mega Milk Fermented Barrier Boosting Facial Oil, zero point nine ounces, fifty four dollars. Hmm. That's E. Where are you? Oh, so small it looks like. Hmm. F. Ulta Beauty Collection Milky Toner, $10. Hmm. Okay, the Ulta Beauty one. Wow. Online only. Oh, okay. Good to know. Online only. Uh, let's see. Tula 24-7 Moisture Intense Ultra Hydrating Day and Night Cream. 1.48 ounces. 54. No. Excuse me. $58. Wow. That's a lot. And then we have what's next? 
cocoa kind oil and oil to milk cleanser 2.9 ounces 18.99 cocoa kind cocoa yeah <laughs> and then we have uh another weird name bioma i believe it's bioma hydrating recovery oil 1.01 ounce 18.99 I have yet to try Bioma, but maybe one day. Voila. Okay. Let's get the page. Okay, all is dewy, all is bright. It's the holidays you deserve stunning skin. Derma. Derma E? Oh, it's one of these, everybody. Wait, no, it has A, B, C, and D, D. Oh, my gosh. It's a two-pager. Wow. Okay, well, this has never happened before. Okay, I'll be reading the back and showing you the front. <coughs> Derma E, buy one, get one 40% off. But that's while supplies last or whenever the deal was. This was a November deal, probably. Probably. Vitamin C, Bright Eyes, Hydro Gel Patches, 3 ounces, $24.95. Those are eye patches? Wow. That's nice. <coughs> and then Dermalogica, Dynamic Skin Retinol, $92. Where are you, Dermalogica? Oh, down there. Oh, lovely. Yes. Oh, yeah. The back. Okay. Oh, I might be. Sorry. If you can't hear me, sorry. I have the book in my front. In in, in my front? In the front. Okay. <laughs> so, this is kind of hard doing it like this. Okay. Let's see. Of course, it's Garnier. Skin Active. There it is. Micellar Cleansing Water with Vitamin C. 13.5 ounces, $11.99. And then next is Province Beauty Daydream Cream. Daydream Cream, yeah. Uh, Adaptogen. Adaptogen Moisturizer. Two ounces, $19.99. For two ounces? There it is. Okay. Peach and Lily Glass Skin Revining, Refining Serum, $39. Peach and Lily. Oh, so cute. Doesn't say how big it is, but looks like it might be small. Looks cute. Okay. We got Juice Beauty Stem Cellular Anti-Wrinkle Booster Serum, one ounce, $80. Mm-hmm. That one, and then I believe it is Beauty Stat again, right next to it. Uh, Universal Sea Skin Refiner Vitamin C Brightening Serum, yes, $85. Okay, and then next is Drunk Elephant H TLC Sukori. Oh, I'm putting it in front of the mic again. Okay, Sukari Baby Facial AHA plus BHA Mask, $80. Hmm. Too pink for me. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, by the way, <laughs> big of pink. My parents bought me a um, cake. Yeah. It was last minute. I think my dad literally literally crossed the street somewhere to go buy a cake for me and bring it over to Shakey's. But it was pink. I thought it was a Barbie cake. We're just going to say it was a Barbie cake because I love Barbie. And of course, Barbie comes with pink and only pink. So we're going to say it's a Barbie cake. Um, <clears throat> yeah, the cake was pink. Okay. I... Where is I? There it is. 
How am I supposed to say this? Exuviance. Exuviance. Advanced series. Okay. Performance peel AP 25 at home. Facial peel $86. And then we got Drunk Elephant again, TLC, Sukori, ba did I read that one already? Yes, I did. Sorry. No, we do not have Drunk Elephant again. We have Bubble. Uh, J. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, it looks like a nail polish. Uh, hmm. Okay. Bubble Daydream Vitamin C and Niacinamide. Tone and Texture Serum, one ounce, seventeen dollars. It's a bubble. It looks like a nail polish. It's yellow. Then Mario, Mario, Badusku, uh, <coughs> Badusku, <laughs> uh, coconut butter cream, a uh, butter, oh, coconut body butter, sixteen dollars. Mm. Looks a little bit like a kale's. Okay, and then oh, mm -hmm, cute. Urban Skin RX Witch Hazing, Witch Witch Hazing, Witch Hazel Brightening and pH Balancing Toner, seventeen ninety nine. Mhm, 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 mhm. Okay, we're finally on the page where I don't have to like. Whew, okay, thank goodness. Okay, M. Supergroup Bright Eyed 100% Mineral Eye Cream SPF 40, $40. It don't tell you how big it is because it looks small. Those look little. Oh, right there. Then you got the Strivectin Super C SPF 30 Moisturizer, $69. Okay, that was the one next to it. And then, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, that is the one next to it. I don't see the name. I think it's on the side. Okay, but it's there. Then. Butter. I guess it's supposed to be like butter, but butter. Let's see. Gotta skip some of the things. They keep repeating, like advertising to buy one, get one. And then they write it in there. Just gotta skip that. Okay. So vitamin C serum. $43. Again, that one. <clears throat> and then Murad Brighton Trial Kit for Dark Spot Correction and Even Tone, $52. That big kit. That's a nice kit. Very nice. After that, we've got Urban Skin RX. Then I got Skip. Uh, Witch Hazel Brightening and pH Balancing Toner, $17.99. Hmm. Okay, that one looks pretty good. And then next to that is Maylee's. Oh man, I actually might be pronouncing that wrong because it has those little two dots above the E. Yeah, so we'll just say Maylee's <laughs> Cosmetics B Glowing. Brightening Body Serum, $59. <clears throat> that one. And that was the one before. Yes. Next, we have Beauty Counter. This big thing here. Uh, let's see. Is that it? Is that all you're going to tell me about them? Oh, 
I see. Okay, so it's going to tell me about... Is it a kid? What? What is... Okay, I'll just read it. it. For some reason, it's... I think it's a kid, but it's actually going to name each product that's in it. That's what it looks like it's to me. So we're just going to read it. Okay. Albright Brightening Facial Oil, 76. Albright Sea Serum, $90. Albright Triple Acid AHA Toner, $68. Then Brightener Days Vitamin C plus AHA kit, $39. Okay. Or maybe it just has two in there. I don't know. I'm not I'm not really sure about this kit. It looks like maybe it just has these two products. And then it named all of those individually. <clears throat> Yeah, it looks like it has the C serum and triple acid. Hmm. Okay. Interesting way they did that. Huh. Okay. Next is just pictures. So I will show you. Got the new L'Oreal Bright Review. Are we in hair care now? Seems like we're in hair care. Is that hair care or is that... Oh, it's a... Whoa. Sunscreen. It's a sunscreen. Okay. So skincare still. Uh, hydrating milk toner. Then number seven, future renew damage reversal serum. Moon glow milky toning lotion from Good Light. Olay super serum. Then Al Al J Al G Al J, Al I don't know. Okay, I'm sorry. I always mess up on that word. Okay, Urban Hydration. That's the brand. I actually, yeah, I have a video about this brand, but it's, uh, I think it was their micellar water. Let's see, Nitrogena or <laughs> Nitrogena, Neutrogena. Uh, the things I say, Neutrogena Hydro Boost. Yes, that would be it. Okay, and then mermaid milk. Earth Harbor mermaid milk. Moisturizer. Wow, that's pretty cool. Next we have the Cetaphil. 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 Healthy Renew Night Cream. Wow. That's just advertisement for all of these, basically. Doesn't tell you the price, nothing, just saying. Some of them say new, some of them are like, I guess. I don't know why they didn't stick all new items. But yeah, there you go. That's what they did. Very interesting. <clears throat> Next is Kobe. Co Next, I'm going to say Kobe. Kobe. Cozy gifts. <laughs> Oh man, I'm I'm making myself laugh so much today. Okay, gifts ten dollars and under. The Vintage Cosmetic Company. Ooh, uh, you got limited editions. Holiday Red Spa Headband. Okay, that's the red headband. It has a bow. It's pretty cute. I have a feeling that they might sell this on Valentine's Day too because it's red. So everyone, look at it. And see if they sell it on Valentine's Day as well. <laughs> it is cute. I kind of want it. I kind of want it because it has the bow. Okay. Uh, headband, $7.99. Okay. Hemp's limited edition. Christmas. Mary Berry Herbal Body Lotion. 2.25 ounces. $7.50. Then the Ulta Beauty Collection. Holiday Loofah with a little ducky in there. That is a duck. Look at them. And then, how much is that? The loofah, 750 yeah. The Cream Body Shop Hello Kitty Sugar Berry Bath Bombs. More Hello Kitty. Wow, Hello Kitty. I feel like... <sighs> I feel like that's definitely something you probably, if they still have it online, 
feel like you're gonna have to get this online because it's probably either destroyed in the stores or just sold out because everybody likes like mentioned before as mentioned before um everybody's looking for hello kitty this year so that might be gone okay <clears throat> gifts 30 dollars and under We've got the Lano, the original 101 Oinman Duo 2850. It's this guy over here. It's a duo. Then, uh, what's next? Nimet? 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 Nimet. <laughs> Vanilla Musk Fragrance Oil, 0.33 ounces, $20.99 each. <gasps> You gotta be kidding me. It's fragrant oil. I would not buy this. I'm not into essential oil things or whatever. Nah. Nah. Okay. <laughs> that is there 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 must be like Twenty ninety nine each. Okay, Tree Hut only here in limited edition at Ulta. Ring in the holidays trio stack gift set. Five point five ounces, sixteen ninety nine. See, mm -hmm. that's a that's a good deal for me. Hmm. Then you have the Ulta Beauty Collection Santa Mystery Bag, twenty dollars. Oh, okay. Oh, you might cut you it's a mystery bag so you might get these i think or you might not not too sure it's a cute headband though let's see gifts at 50 dollars and under oh we went up in price the body shop slather and nourish body buddy <laughs> body buddy butter <laughs> gift said 34 dollars a 40 dollar value and then again repeated items they're repeating items um the truly coco coco cloud shave heroes uh shaving kit 42 dollars and 90 cents then the patisserie bath ball set 55 dollars value of 30 oh wait set 55 dollar value is $37. Oh, they flipped them. You guys flipped them. Who is writing this magazine? <laughs> I'm just kidding. There you go. Bath bombs. My cousin used to make bath bombs. That's where I was getting my bath bombs. <clears throat> okay. Oh my. You almost done? This is a lot. Ooh, and then we got hair. Oh, we might not finish it today. I was hoping we would. How are we doing on time? Oh, man. I was hoping we would be able to finish it today. Hair care. We're into hair care now, everybody. Um, oh, man, I'm going to have to go. My movie is at 6.15. <laughs> it's not expecting that. All right, we got, oh, we are almost done, actually. One, two, three, four, five. Five more pages left. Jeez, five, six, seven, eight. We only did three pages? What, 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 what? Gifts that shimmer. Okay, hair care. This is going to be probably my last page. Because... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. We got a Pureology Hydrate. Pureology Hydrate full size kit, $55. Oh, I did do the Nick Nocturnal rock and roll rolling. That's what, that's what happened. Then we've got the Verb only here, Where's Ghost, $25. Mm. That is a video I made about the ghost oil. There's the ghost oil. It's a whole gift set. Mm -hmm. We got, oh, Lola V. This is 
I believe it is. This is the Jennifer Aniston product. That's her brand or her face on the brand for now. And then I pick a different set of Liberty, maybe? I don't know. Or it is. It might be hers. From what I heard, it might be hers. Um, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> These celebrity things are kind of, they fade away sometimes. Okay. Restore and protect travel kit, $40. Hmm. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. What's going on here? Woo! Here we go. I'm going to fix that. Okay, that's the best I could do. <laughs> and then we've got lost my place. Biolage. Biolage. This is Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Ultra Hydro Source Holiday Kit, $30, a $53 value. That's pretty nice. For very dry hair. Oh. Oh, darn. Oh, it's looking really nice to me. Ah, uh, I do not have very dry hair. Bummer. I'm not going to be able to get that. It'll be too heavy for my hair. Ah, uh, it's looking very nice. Okay. Uh, we have only here... Batiste Refresh to Impress Sugar Plum Dry Shampoo Kit $16.99 Yes, please. I like their dry shampoos. They are pretty good for me. Uh, let's see. Then we have <coughs> IGK Only Here Good Vibes Only Kit at $49.50 Hmm. Yes. Uh, I don't remember if I have. I know I have an IGK product. I don't remember which one it was. And then next. Chi. Only here again. Pink 1.5 Titanium Flat Iron 109.99. Este. Right there. Okay. And then next time we're going to do this page. One. Two. Three. Should be five pages. Three. Four. And then five. They actually went to full deal detail with these. With the uh, hair care. That's what I was not expecting too. Like every single page has price uh size full detail look look at this even the individual pictures you know how i'm usually like oh this page just has pictures no it, everything is full detail with hair care hmm interesting i wonder why they did that even scared skincare when they had like this page just has pictures <laughs> all right that i was not expecting okay so we're gonna have to stop right there and we will continue with the hair care next week yes i will still be my hair my hair today i will still be going live even though I am on vacation, I do like to spend a little time with you guys still. So uh, what else am I going to do on my weekends? Um, but say hello. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, I like the color down here, though. It's coming off very nicely. Okay. So that is all. I will see you guys another time. Thank you very much for watching. And thank you for joining me on Vony Nat. I was... Uh, I don't know, I just wanted to share with you guys that I was going to do it right away, but I was like, no, 
give me some time. Let me think about my choices. I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did. And, um, <clears throat> and then I just wanted to share with you guys. Yeah. All right. Uh, see you guys. Okay. Yes. Keep on loving makeup <laughs> and keep on rocking. Yeah. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye, bye, bye. Uh, I'm going to finish celebrating my birthday. Probably going to have to get ready and go drive to the movies right now. Ooh.